The Turkish government plans to convert the TCG Anadolu L-400, which is the Turkish Navy's amphibious assault warship LHD, into a light aircraft carrier for its combat drone aircraft. After being removed from the JSF program as a result of purchasing the S-400 air defense system, the Turkish Navy lost the ability to launch fighters from Anadolu. The CEO of the Baker Company, Hayluk Bayraktar said that the company will develop a new UCAV that can take off and land on the Anadolu deck within one year. Ismail Demir, president of the Turkish government's defense industry, said his company was working on Baker's Bayraktar TB2 and other unmanned fixed-wing projects to turn Anadolu into an unmanned aircraft carrier. With such a configuration, at least 10 armed drones can be used simultaneously in operations and integrated into the command and control center on board. After the drone project for aircraft carriers is completed, there will be at least 30 to 50 TB3 drones that can land and take off from Anadolu. The TB3 drone developed from TB2 is expected to have a larger size and payload. The Anadolu was originally designed for the F-35B which could carry out a short takeoff vertical landing, therefore aircraft with conventional takeoff and landing capabilities such as Turkish drones would have difficulty operating from this ship, therefore Turkish officials wanted modifications to this ship. However, if this is done, the ship will experience delays. The drone carrier will also be a new operational concept. As the current drones do not have a 2A capability, it seems that their objective is the ISR, as well as small-scale attack operations, besides that the drone can also be used as a Sonabui carrier platform for ASW missions.